So this was an interesting headline this morning. We have heard former President Trump claim all along, and there are a number of sort of ties between the teams. Um, but what clear evidence has come to light that that causes you to go this step further? Well, President Trump is absolutely right. The illicit nature of these witch hunt prosecutions is self-evident to anyone paying attention, uh, broadly speaking, but specifically Alvin Bragg's prosecution at the Manhattan District Attorney's Office. It's not supported by the facts or the law. And I would remind viewers that at the end of the day, all attorneys are held to a certain rules of professional conduct and prosecutors are actually held to a heightened standard of rules. It's illicit to bring a frivolous case and that's what's happening here. But what we're not focused enough on and what this uh, request seeks to expose is the illicit motivations of the prosecutors themselves. Alvin Bragg sued President Trump and then campaigned on a promise to uh, prosecute so this morning in my live video, I asked the question, why the state of Missouri and the AG alleges connection between Biden and White House in terms of the Trump prosecutions? He goes so far as to say, hey, is this election uh, interference? So of course, I said, let me find out about Missouri. And so I looked at the governor, right? I looked at the governor, I looked at the state. Okay, so Missouri is the 24th state in the Union, August 10th of 1821. Why is 24 important? The 24th letter of the alphabet is X. I've been teaching that. Isn't that deep? It just so happened the AG is from Missouri bringing this case against won the paperwork from Biden about this possible uh, fraudulent case. 24, interesting. Then look here. The governor is Mike Parsons. His birth date is September 17th of 1955. Always look to see who's, what governor or mayor allegedly is sacrificing somebody. Allegedly. September 17th. Watch that's this. September 17th. Just had a birthday of 2023 versus today's date, 5-11 of 2024. The difference is 33 weeks and six days, right? Devil's number six to take out man. Same thing here. You have September 17th. The birthday is coming up for the governor, right? Versus today's date. Today's date, the difference is 46. 46 can be looked at as two ways. 46 is always sacrifice. George Floyd and JFK were sacrificed at 46 years old, allegedly. So 46 plus Joe Biden is the 46th president. Four months, six days. Then look at this. Today's date, 5-11-24 versus Trump's birthday, 6-14-2024 coming up. The difference is also 46. Four weeks, six days. Hmm. Wow, Missouri, the governor, the date, Trump. And look at this, 5-11, today's date, versus 4-8. 4-8 was the day of the uh, eclipse. The difference is what, 33, like Masonic. I say it's speaking. 5-11, today's date, versus what? Election day, 120 or 2025. Difference is 36-3. And like I said, Mike Parsons, September 17th, I just brought it up to today's date. And the 24th state is Missouri. That might explain why this attorney general is making his case, allegedly, because it reflects the 24 and the X of Donald Trump. How far will this case go? Will Biden and company allegedly pull out the five Ds? Delay, deny, debate, derail, and destroy? Will Biden make it through until the Democratic National Convention? And will Trump make it through? It's deep, y'all. I'll see you guys tonight, 6 p.m. Central, live here in Chicago, live show. God bless you. God bless your family. Stay tuned. The saga continues. Nothing but a distraction, but hey. Let's see how our governance works.